Lesson one. What is a top? There are gel scrubs. Most of them are made of wood, though some other materials is iron and plastic. There are also many ways to play gel scrubs, such as large gel scrubs that need to be weighted, and small gel scrubs can be turned by hand. After observing, we know that the gel scrub is composed of the main body of the gel scrub and the gel loop and top tip. There will be grooves on the main body of the gel scrub that need to be whipped. When we whip the top, it will rot quickly. Why doesn't the top fall? First of all. We need to understand a physical knowledge of centrifugal force, which is what we often call inertia. This is a virtual force, an embodiment of inertia, which makes a rotating object away from its center of rotation. Because the motion of the gyroscope is composed of two motions. The rotating around the center axis and the reverse corning motion of the central axis around the vertical line. A particle close to the vertical line, the line perpendicular to the plane in the picture, and the particle farthest away from the vertical line, are selected as reference. The reverse conical motion. Makes one of the two particles accelerate and the other decelerates, leading to the unbalanced force in the horizon. Building a simple top. After a simple understanding of the centrifugal force, let's make a simple gyroscope and let it rotate. This is a simple gyroscope. Put the top and the large rope. Quickly pull out the large rope; it will rotate. Thinking, how to make gyroscope rotate stable? The swing angle of gyroscope is determined by the speed of rotation around its axis. The slower the rotation, the larger the swing angle. The worst stability we get. The faster the rotation. The smaller the swing angle, so the better stability we get. Remember what we said about the centrifugal force. Please see below the formula of the centrifugal. Now, what are you waiting for? Let's start to race whose gyro has longer rotation time.